the good ship Venus, you really should have seen us with a figurehead, a whore in bed, and a mast of a phallic genus. The captain of a lugger was known as a filthy bugger, declared unfit to shovel grit from one ship to another. Aboard the good ship Venus, you really should have seen us with a figurehead, a whore in bed, and a mast of a phallic genus. was chipper, a randy little nipper. He made a pass with a broken glass and circumcised the skipper. Aboard the good ship Venus, you really should have seen us, with a figurehead, a whore in bed, and a mast of a phallic genus. The first mate's name was Morgan, by gosh he was a gorgon. From half past eight he'd play till late upon the captain's organ. Aboard the good ship Venus, you really should have seen us. With a figurehead, a whore in bed, and a mast of a phallic genus. Captain's wife was Charlotte, born and bred a harlot. Her thighs at night were lily white, by morning they were scarlet. Aboard the good ship Venus, you really should have seen us. With a figurehead, a whore in bed, and a mast of a phallic genus. Captain's daughter Mabel, though young, was fresh and able to fornicate with the second mate upon the chart room table. Aboard the good ship Venus, you really should have seen us with a figurehead, a whore in bed, and a mast of a phallic genus. Captain's youngest daughter was washed into the water. Her plaintive squeals announced that eels had found her sexual quarter. Aboard the good ship Venus, you really should have seen us. With a figurehead, a whore in bed, and a mast of a phallic genus. The ship's dog's name was Rover. We turned that poor thing over and ground and ground that faithful hound from Tenerife to Dover. Aboard the good ship Venus, you really should have seen us. With a figurehead, it was a whore in bed and a mast of a phallic genus. When we reached our station, through skillful navigation, the ship got sunk in a wave of spunk from too much fornication. Aboard the good ship Venus, you really should have seen us, with a figurehead, a whore in bed, and a mast of a phallic genus. Take up the sheets, me hearties, water the deck with brine. Bend to the oars, you lousy whores, none is bigger than mine. Three old whores from Winnipeg were drinking a sherry wine. Says one of them to the other two, yours is smaller than mine. So take up the sheets, me hearties, water the deck with brine. Bend to the oars, you lousy whores, none is bigger than mine. You're a liar, says the other old whore. Mine's as big as the sea. The battleships sail in and out and never a bother to me. So take up the sheets, me hearties. Water the deck with wine. Bend to the oars, you lousy whores. None is bigger than mine. You're a liar, says the other old whore. Mine's as big as the moon. The ships sail in on the first of the year. They never come out till June. Pick up the sheets, me hearties. Water the deck with brine. Bend to the oars, you lousy whores. None is bigger than mine. You're a liar, says the other old whore. Mine's as big as the air. The ships sail out and the ships sail in and they never tickle the hair. Oh, take up the sheets, me hearties. Water the deck with brine. Bend to the oars, you lousy whores. None is bigger than mine. You're a liar, says the first again. I'd blush to be so small. Many's the fleet that sailed right in and never come out at all. So take up the sheets, me hearties. Water the deck with brine. Bend to the oars, you lousy whores. None is bigger than mine. Young sailor who looked through the 
glass Spied a fair mermaid with scales on her island Where seagulls fly over their nests She combed the long hair that hung over her shoulders And caused her to tickle and itch The sailor cried out There's a beautiful mermaid setting out there on the rocks The crew come a-running a-grabbing their glasses And crowded for deep to the rail All eager to share in this fine piece of news Which the captain soon heard from the watch He tied down the wheel And he reached for his crackers and cheese Which he kept near the door In case he might someday encounter a mermaid He knew he must use all his wits Crying, throw out a line We'll lasso her flippers And then we will certainly find If mermaids are better before Or be brave, my good fellows The captain then said With fortune we'll break through her mermaid And heading to starboard They tacked with dispatch Caught that fair mermaid Just under her elbows And hustled her down below decks Each took a turn at her famine And setting her free At the end of the farce She splashed in the waves Landing flat on her After a while one man noticed some scabs Soon they broke out With the pox and the scrap Scratching with fury, cursing with spleen. The song may be dull, but it's certainly clean. I was a serving maid down in Drury Lane. My master A was good to me, my mistress was the same. When along come a sailor on shore at liberty, and out to my wow he took liberty with me. Singing a bell bottom trousers, coats a navy blue. Let him climb the rigging like his daddy used to do. It was at a ball I met him, he asked me for a dance. I knew he was a sailor by the way he wore his pants. His shoes was neatly polished and his hair was neatly combed. After the ball was over, he asked to see me home. Singing a bell bottom trousers, coats a navy blue. Let him climb the rigging like his daddy used to do. He asked me for an handkerchief to tie around his head He asked me for a candle to light his way to bed I, a foolish maiden, not thinking it no harm I jumped into the sailor's bed to keep the sailor warm Singing a bell bottom trousers, coats a navy blue Let him climb the rigging like his daddy used to do I knowed he was no Samson, but that night he went to town. He laid me on the bed there till my blue eyes turned to brown. And early in the morning, before the break of day, a twelve-pound note he gave me and some warning words to say. Singing a bell bottom trousers, coats a navy blue. Let him climb the rigging like his daddy used to do. He said, take this, my darling, for the damage I have done. You may have a daughter, you may have a son. If you have a daughter, jounce it on your knee. And if you have a son, send the bastard out to say. Singing the bell bottom trousers, coats a navy blue. Let him climb the rigging like his daddy used to do. Now listen all you maidens to my girlish plea Don't ever let a sailor get his hand upon your knee I trusted one once and he put off to sea And left me with the daughter to bounce upon my knee Singing a bell bottom trousers, coats a navy blue Let him climb the rigging like his daddy used to do